Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome back to the 12th episode of Shadowrun Hong Kong. Today, we're going to go to the bunk. We're going to sleep because we talked to Gauchu and the other guys last time. Ooh, <laughs> optional, get some rest. You awake with a start, your limbs bound up in a sweaty tangle of linen bed sheets. An incredible sorrow swells in your chest. You feel empty, half starved, and alone. Fragmented, fragmentary memories of a half remembered dream flit through your mind. They're already fading away into nothing. Let them fade. We don't want to chase them. You blink three, four times, letting seconds pass between closing your eyes and opening them again. Shake your head. Something is nagging you, a lingering unease. All at once, the memories hit you with the force of a sledgehammer, cracking dead center into your forebrain. The walled city. You were back in the walled city. You don't remember how you got there, but it couldn't have been any place else. Even the barons weren't so squalic. Squalid. Remember... Craning your neck to look above you, the buildings that made up part of this walled city were new construction, even cheaper than the old. Now their foundations had rotted out from under them, and the buildings leaned into one another like a gang of drunken men. A rain of plaster and asbestos sprinkled down, dusting your shoulders. You begin to creep forward, picking your way past piles of refuse and debris. Past the pimps and the duster fires, the broken glass and the dirty needles, the air reeked of rot and sewage and industrial waste, a disgusting melange that caught your sinuses and crawled down your throat. You gagged on the stink, but it didn't slow you down. In the back of your mind, you knew that it had no reason for doing this. There was nothing for you in the walled city. You shouldn't have been there. But the rest of you was hungry, unbearably, indescribably hungry. And that part of you knew that if you keep going, you'd finally get to eat. As you forced your way deeper into the walled city, locals stood at their windows and stared unexpectedly. Some of them dropped to their knees. You kept moving. You can see something in the distance, a silhouette, something enormous, at least twice the size of a troll, but delicate. It was beautiful. The huge figure beckoned you, gesturing with a slender limb. An explosion of warmth, warmth filled your chest, and you knew that only if you could reach it, your problems would be over. She would make all your sorrows disappear. You moved forward at a crawl, but your figure felt impossibly far away. You reached out, calling to her, and... and you woke up. The feeling in your stomach slowly fades, and the taking the strength and vibrance of the memories along with it. Wow. Dreams, man. They're intense. Okay, let's, uh... We did to get some rest. We can travel to the Sky Tower of the Wuzing... Wuzing Inks Feng Shui. I got it right. Did I do it right this time? Feng Shui. Okay, uh, that's the bunk. Oh, it's this one. Okay. I don't really want to talk to anyone else. I kind of just want to keep going and... And not really talk to all these side quests anymore. It's getting just so long and, and not much fun involved for me and you. But uh, what we're going to do is we're going to take these upgrade points and see what we can do with them. Uh, spend karma. I want to get the continuing going on the melee stuff. The body increases. Because we got a good body there. Like our hair is just wonderful. We got that shampoo that gives it a really great body. Uh, quickness. Okay, that's a hit in ranged combat. And then we got ranged combat here. Overwatch. Overwatch is uh, how do you how do you describe it? It's difficult to describe. It's like a uh, opportunity attack, basically. SMG. Um. Hmm. I don't know what else to do. I could put seven there, but that eat up a lot. Let's just do one there. We got. Uh, we'll get the monofilament whip. Okay. I like that. And then we'll do we'll do range combat four. So we should get Overwatch and did we get hmm, yeah that's all we can get. So maybe we'll continue on the quickness and maybe dodge in a little bit. Okay, so show should get the SMG stuff. But let's see. Flush target. Loses cover bonus. Okay, confirm. Okay, we spent our karma. And we can go talk in there again. We could go down here and see if we could actually get that whip. See if there's any more of the uh, cyberware that we can use. Hello, Armless Joe. Show me your services. Show a thing, cyberware. Okay, what do we got? We got uh, 1540 new yen. Bone, ooh, one bone, that's nice. Okay, those are arms. We have cyberware there. Now, all installs. We have the cyber weapon. Let's see if there's something else. It should have been the whip, right? There's the data jack. I really like that. Uh, the data jack, I think we can connect it to... Oh, we already have the eye one. Magnification eyes, plus 3% to hit. 
Nice. Oh, we can actually check by individual place. Yeah, <laughs> that's cool. Um, let's see, what's that do? Passive plus one dodge, more hit points. Plus one thrown weapons. Don't care about that. We don't have enough money to buy the leg installs. There's the arms. We can do skin. We can do body. Plus one body. What does that do? Let's let's take a look at what body does. Besides, makes our hair wonderful. Oh, I can't look at it. Um, I thought it was in here. Gives us more hit points. Shoot. I don't know. We'll just we'll just uh. We'll just chill for a while. And we'll do another, maybe two quests. Hopefully we can finish up the next one. I don't know which one to do next. Um, I kind of want to take Gai Chu and that new, that new rigger too. kind of want to take them into our adventure. Not really sure which one to go to, though. Okay. Uh, loot a dig site in a museum for Drake. Yeah, that sounds cool. We'll do that. All right, the Decker. We'll take the Decker. And I, I really like, hmm, I don't really like the rigor. Security specialist is kind of cool, but I wanted to try out the samurai. Again, but he's only melee damage. Let's just take our, no, I don't want you. I want, what's your face? Got it. I want the shaman for the healing powers. Okay, skills. I don't know what I have in my inventory, but I haven't used much of anything. Let's confirm. Emperor's Tomb Museum continue. Let's do this. See what happens here. This job is a golden opportunity. In more ways than one. A raid of in-developed... In-development museum, the Emperor's Tomb. Museum's claim to fame is its location. It rests on top of ancient catacombs, where excavation is underway to convert them into a museum proper. Intel has it that the workers are dying, not from on-site accidents, but from magical disturbances in the area. Despite the hazards, development continues. Your client, Mr. Drake, contacted you to re retrieve two tomes, probably ancient, magical, priceless. It won't, wouldn't it be shame? It won't be in the shame, ah, but it won't be a smash in the park. You have to get the tomes before they're cataloged where they'll afterward be near impossible to access. As you near the museum, its height and grandeur looms and settling over you. It's unfinished. Yeah, even unfinished, it's reached an imposing size. At least that means there's plenty of room for pricey antiques. Best part? Mr. Drake needs this run to look unprofessional. Shattered glass and looting is encouraged. Yes! Okay. We don't really have anything else. So? Really, I don't. I have a grenade, and I've got those drugs. Just confirm it. Game's autosave, that's always good. Smash and grab, stealing loot, and leaving like a boss. All right. Entry work, just like Drake said. You creep into the dark, unfinished sight. Your comm link clicks in your ear, connecting to a call. Good. I'll be appraising what you see as you go through the floor. Grab the best stuff, and my alarm suppression should keep you afloat. Just don't get too ballsy. If the books haven't been cataloged yet, They'll still be in the basement, the tomb. I'll be in touch. Earpiece clicks off. Call disconnected. He didn't even say, stay on the line long enough to get a word in. Your team powers up the nearby generator. Work lights, even in the new marble flooring, sleepily flicker to life. Everyone surveys the site. You know, I've always wanted to do something like this. What do you mean? These artifacts have all been stolen from the earth. So now, we get to teach a lesson to the man who's excavating it. That these were never truly his. All right. But we're thieves ourselves. We're stealing things for one man to give to another. To give them to another man. These artifacts don't belong to him either. Oh, he'll get what he deserves too. Objects like these are too bright to remain in some vault or display case. More thieves will be drawn to them, like moths to a diode. I'm just excited to be part of the cycle. Alright. That sounds kind of cool. Steal 5,000 worth, steal 10,000 worth, find both ancient books. Oh, sweet. Steel. Dragon scales. <gasps> Is that a youth raptor? I want this. Even though it's cheap. No, I'm gonna take it. Alarms. Oh, so we can only steal ten things. Got it. 
What is this one? Neanderthal skeleton. King's ashes. Oh, there's another one. Oh, a plesiosaur jawbone. There's going to be good stuff in the basement here. Shoot. Okay. We'll take that one. And we'll take this one. I could take more, I guess. This one is worth quite a bit, too, I thought. Karma gained! Yeah, buddy! Alright. I shouldn't have taken that 30 New Yen one. Open door, please don't. Okay, it didn't. Is this a tome? What do we got in here, dudes? Terminal. Welcome, Lao Zhang. Please input your passport to log in. Access the login field. It's Bill. Can I get a hand with this lock in the screen? On it! She clanks out a few command strings in the terminal. Easy, this section of the OS has a security hole that'll let me bypass the password without cracking it. Just have to spoof our credentials. Here we go. The root menu. Access the file system. Business related files in the sub menu. Uh, let's see. Among the saved emails, three recent ones stand out. Per our previous discussion, I've attached to this email the revised museum blueprints. The prints outline various changes to the structure and the building materials that need to be implemented as soon as possible. Some backtracking may be necessary, but it'll cut supply and building costs by over 13% without compromising the museum size and grandeur. I know you're against it, but the production output will have to increase in order to meet our end-of-year unveiling. I'll leave it up to you to figure out the details, but if I... Find that you and your team are slacking off again. More cuts will be made. As to the loss of your co-worker, Mr. Fi, I offer you can, my condolences. However, we both know that construction is dangerous work and the accidents are commonplace. You can look at this as an opportunity to hire someone more competent and won't get himself killed. Museum details. Previous discussion I've attached to this email, blah, blah, blah. I already did this one, didn't I? Yeah. On-site accident. Proceed. I processed your informal request yesterday morning. Given a persuasive pittance, the five family agreed to forego public retribution regarding the loss of Mr. Quine Fei. He is the fourth laborer lost to hazardous work conditions. Public image is very important to the corporation, and unlikely another transgression will go unnoticed. As your lawyer, I must advise you to double down on your construction safety protocols, or to seek an alternative to monetary bribes. Money will buy silence in the short term, but we ultimately want a more permanent solution. I'll forward the contact information of a Ganjin funded organization that will assist you with such matters. Okay. Retracting investment. Dear Mr. Ping, I can assure you that the recent rumors regarding construction, infraction, worker fatalities, and malpractice are all untrue. Complete fiction invented by the local gossip circuits to stir up trouble for hardworking men like myself. Okay. Root menu. Let's see. Office room controls. Yeah. Ooh, it appears the room is rigged to respond to computer-generated commands. These options are a few. Ambient candlelight, business casual, restricted actus. Okay, let's do that one. Submenu is locked with a password. Uh, Isabel, why is this menu still locked? Saunders the terminal better look. Hmm, this area has a different password and hashing system. The spoof I was able to do earlier won't get through here. Any good guesses? Um... Um, we don't have any good guesses. Let's go to the root menu. Office room controls, remote building controls. Error, building controls offline. Network and connectivity fail. Okay, so we need to find the password for him. Let's leave. Let's see if it's in somewhere else. Check bookshelf. Eh. Standard stained wood. Man. Too dumb to look at the books. I'm not strong enough to pull the bookshelf. It's probably where the password was. What's this? Inspect. Oh. The Lady of Shalott, 1888. I wonder if that's the password. I seriously doubt it. Negative. So, I have to have decking one, but... Isabel can't do it, even though she's right there with me. Or, er, Gobbit. Which one's the Decker? I don't remember. That's 
That's a little weird. I don't like that. Security terminal. Terminal's powered off. Okay, then. Thank you for letting me interact with it. Go downstairs. And take a drink. Okay, what do we have in here? So we have four more alarms. We need like 5,000 more money out of this. What's this? Inspect. Do not enter. Okay. There's got to be something here. Is that a tome? I hear something like skittering. There's like these little, there's all sorts of boxes and stuff too, which would indicate to me that there'll be a fight in here. You guys seen anything? I'm not. There's something that's a data jack terminal. Do we go in here? I don't think so. Let's go down here quick. Thing back in here, a giant vase. Vase? Is it a vase if it's fancy and a vase if it's not? Probably. Oh. Okay, so a gargoyle. A gargoyle and a mummified corpse walk into a room. Gargoyle says, what's up, brother? And the corpse doesn't say anything. That's a good joke, wasn't it? Let's try to this terminal first. Glad I saw them. Shipping terminal. Jackie and Isabel. All right. Ooh, so we get to go into our first, uh, our first, go to the Matrix for the first time, I guess. We got our programs, we got our SBs, ESPs, and the programs are like your skills or your spells, and the ESPs are basically your, um, I don't even know what they're called. Are we going in? All right. The Matrix. Help slide will give you a rundown on some of the features you'll encounter navigating through cyberspace, including System Trace, Matrix Combat, and Watcher Ice. Show help. Wow. So this is actually the entire help menu. There's different ices here. Black Ice, White Ice, and Watcher Ice. So we can... Hmm. Do not trip the museum alarm. Okay. Cool. So that's like a Watcher Ice there. Let's open your deck up. No, I just left, didn't I? You gotta go back in. This is a little different menu than the last game. Okay. So he's looking back and forth like a beast. I think that one's doing the same. We might be able to run in here. Do you see me? They saw me. Okay, let's make a program. And this will create like a little dude who we can use to do stuff. Line of sight blocked. Is there anything in the line of sight? Still line of sight blocked. I don't like that. Especially since I used up both of my turns in the open. You missed. He's right in the open and you missed him. There we go. Oh, 50 damage. That's right. Okay. Oh, he's just going to move. And they're getting trace. So trace down here is kind of the, uh, the alarm state, so to speak. So we can continue attacking it. Maybe we can kill it straight up. Good. He's done. Okay, so we did get a little trace. I can open this back. Oh, I guess I can't. Shoot! Ah. Okay, what are these, dude? Sniffer. Call for attack. Directed at one target. 150. Oh, I missed him. No! There we go. Okay, so we've got our traces going way up. 
If we get seen, something bad happens. I forget what it is. I think that's where we need to go. Okay, I'm going to watch this pattern here. Wow. Can they actually not... I guess they can't see. Is there any specific blocks? So you can see there. You can actually see everywhere. Okay, kill it. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, I got more trays coming up. Let's uh, use this suppression. Suppression. That brings that way down. Okay. We'll use the, the kill 2.0 again. Flank damage. Oh, we missed it. No way. Didn't die. He's going to see me again. Move back. Okay, he's flanked again. That was nasty. Alright, next up. Can I seriously not? No, I can't. This is kind of a big maze here. I'm scared of it. No, we have to watch a little bit longer. Can they see everything? Okay. He comes down. And then back over. And up. This one can see like four blocks away, so you can see it here. I wonder if it's best to, to come this way and over. As soon as he passes or to follow him. Follow him and then follow him down. Maybe. Yeah, that's what we're going to have to do. We're going to follow behind him. And then we can camp out. Ooh, and then follow him up. Follow. No, keep going up. We might be seen. This might should we fight through it? If he can see us... I don't know. I did it. I think that was right. Okay, yes. Oh, and there's two of these. So there's the blocker ice. Okay, you can either attempt to hack the ice or force your way past the additional system trace. Okay, we need to look at the hacking slide because I need to figure out how to do it. Uh, no. Okay, there's a puzzle. Blocker ice encounters. Press start and follow the match sequence using your numpad or mouse. And oh, great! This is great for a dyslexic. Yeah, we don't have fifty. Let's try it. Okay. Heck time. Start. Oh, come on. It was 5793. And I was trying to do it as it was going. 5614. Okay. 4159. 1, 739 nine. Ah, seven three three nine. Three six nine three nine nine three six. Got it. Three eight one seven seven nine seven. Three eight one seven seven nine seven. Did it! I did something. I did it, dudes. What's happening? Am I supposed to do something now? No. What? It's this one. 
You match that one with it. Did we do it? Hey, we did something cool. Data store shipping. Aha! We got the shipping manifest. Cool. Okay, we need to go get that one now. It's the same relative deal. Oh. That's intense, man. Might be too tense. Like a TP and a wigwam together. Let's run. Run, brother. Sister. Weird sheep lady. Go, 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 go! You made it. Okay. We can do it. Hacker. Okay, here we go. Ah, it's the Simon thing again. Six, six, seven, five. I got it. I got one. Three, four, four, three. Got it, two. Five, five, three, five, five. Nine, eight, six, six, two. Three, 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 one, six, seven. Two, eight, six, six, nine, nine. Oh, great. I did it all at once. Okay, so we got that one first. M, M, this one? M? I think it was this one. I think I did it again. Oh, I'm getting good at this game. Ooh, and I just what was seen. We got spells. Oh, nice. Very cool. Let's take it. That's a mage spell that we got. Um, we'll just put it in our stash. Okay. Now we got to get our bad selves out of Dodge City. Out of the old Kansas here. That's a something crazy there. Go. Come back up. Look at this. Look at this. I'm making it. I'm making it like a boss. Like a boss mode. Whee! Alright, you're here still. Is there anything else going to be around? It shouldn't be too hard. That might have been everything we needed. I think that is everything in here. There might be something else that I'm missing. If there is... Whoops. Jack out. Alright, what do we get? We got the shipping manifesto. Hey, we got two, two uh, brownie points, too. Mission items. Shipping manifest. Catalogs, the coming and going of rare artifacts to be displayed in the museum. Could be worth some new yen to the right buyer. Cool. Oh, that was a little scary. It's the first time we've done that, isn't it? We're going to get a little fight here, too. Take out the gargoyle. Do we want to kill the gargoyle? I guess we do. Do you see that? Yes, I do. Can I get you in a place? Let me get everyone in place first. Gob it. Overwatch. Blitz. Overwatch. See, that's the overwatch. You sit like an attack if they move, then they attack. I wonder what his range is. I want to get him too close. I think I'm going to put him back here. I'm going to overwatch him as well. Now you. Summon spirit. Very nice. Okay, what are these? Smash. Can't do that. Petrify. Oh, missed him. Uh oh. Rock skin. I'm blitz. Armor increased. We're gonna go like a beast mode now. All right, come up here. Have you in the front. Gobbit, come back here. And it. Well, we don't need to fire really. He's gonna come in here anyway. There's the Overwatch. Ah, perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. Oh, there's another one I didn't see. He's immune. What was that? What? So the little spirit dude just totally... Oh, he took him into a different... Oh, he teleported it. What? Okay. I want to go, like... 
Wait, we can use we can use spells and stuff to get rid of damage or er, yeah, this strips two armor. Okay, armor. Him again. Missed it. Okay, Isabel, we want to cast on Oh, we don't need to heal wounded. Let's just attack this guy. Please don't hit my buddy. Good work. Do an aim shot, 97%. Very good. Oh man, he's taking so much. We'll do this one too. Oh, gross, a nasty cloud of goop. We're still in combat. I don't know what to do. We need to move Blitz out of there because he's getting killed. Okay, we gotta kill. We gotta kill this thing. So that does one stun. Come over here, smash him, stun him down. Good. And then just totally kill him. All right, welcome back, my brother, from another mother. Oh, I like this guy. I need like 12 of them in my life. I'm just gonna overwatch. Oh, well, hello there. Where did these guys come from? Shoot, there's three of them, what? No wonder, four of them? Oh, very cute. Very, very cute. There's another one. Where do these guys keep coming from? Oh, that's the one we already killed. Uh, let's switch to guns. Okay, he's down. I don't know what to do here. Shotty time. Let's shoot the grenade. I know it's gonna hurt our own dude. That's okay. He did 10 damage. He's like, dude, what are you doing to me? Okay, now I'm gonna take you. We're gonna heal the wounded. Cause that'll give him 22 hit points. Can I, can I actually get you out of here first? That would probably have been a better idea rather than just taking straight up damage, wouldn't it? Dum da dum dum dum. Grenade time. Wow, that's a huge splash. Okay, aim shot. Take that guy out. Gobbit, you're wounded. We could give someone aim increase or we can just kill. Two damage. It's got so much damage reduction. Oh, sap in the willpower. Oh, and it took you to the, the nasty land, too. Oh, great. Old nasty land down here. Okay, you gotta reload. Should we switch over and attack? Give me the old, the old one, two, slicey slice. I think I'm gonna try it. Now, nah, let's try Duncan first. Let's get him away. We don't need to. Not enough AP. Okay. Booyah! Don't have any bullets. Oh, yeah, let's just can reload. Now, Gobbit should be able to take it out. Switch guns. Attack. Poison fog. We can aim. So we gotta keep running away from this thing. We'll keep it in flank. Okay, he died. I'm gonna keep running away. Just keep it in flank mode, then I'll be better. Ah! Wounded four. I guess these guys could maybe pass. I don't know. I'm gonna keep the overwatch up for sure. Don't hit her. No! I'm gonna do a heal. 
to run away. I should have done that. Oh, I should have done that. Out of ammo. That didn't really heal well. One damage. Cute. I don't know how to get in there. Is there a way into the spirit world thing? wonder if I come over here if I can get inside that thing. Oh, yes. Okay, you ran away. Ha! Huh? Why did you run away? Come on back. Okay. There we go. Well, that was interesting. That was very interesting. Let's pick up the other tome. That's two or three. Your comlink crackles. You've got the books. Great. Next, you need to head upstairs and I can wipe the security data. Then you're home free. Did you know these creatures were in here? No. I had planned this run down to last detail, but those monsters were a happy accident. Happy accident. They tried to kill me. They also killed all the researchers, Brent, preventing these books from being cataloged. Finding them would have been a lot harder had these creatures not come along. Now time's wasting. Security rooms at the top of the stair leading back to the museum floor. And he's gone from the comm link. So where's all this other loot that I'm supposed to snag? I hope everyone's health is okay. I guess I could use... Yeah. What's that? Elemental fetish? Oh, yeah. Okay. You know, we're at 37 minutes as well. I think we'll just continue going on this. Finish this off. Because why not? You know, we're, we're doing something right. And if you guys want to watch this anyway, you're going to watch it. So, I don't have to worry about anything really happening. And I could probably watch... Oh, my! A cadaverous, cadaverous husk materializes in front of you, unfolding like a flower from nothingness into being. It is standing surprisingly upright posture, and it can see that its robes were once of fine quality. It raises a hand to block your path. Stop! Comes out a hollow rasp, something it feels empty. It seems you can move freely through this realm, coming and going, taking what is not yours. What are you? Oh yeah, what are you? I was once a man much as you are. Now I'm a dead man. My soul is bound to this place and I cannot leave. This place is bizarre. What's happening down here? The books you carry, they are alive. They protect themselves, distort space, and draw creatures to them who they will serve. Are exalted. Had the will to contain them. Wherever you intend to sell them, I hope that an equally strong mind will keep them under control. So I... Uh, you think I can get you out of here somehow? Yes, you can. Slowly, painfully, the mummy inclines his hand and reaching into the folds of the ropes produces a ring of fired porcelain. Ooh, the creature extends its arm, presenting its object as an offering. Take this talisman and place it to the other artifacts you have removed. Once you have moved it beyond the binding threshold of this excavation, I will be three. Okay. Thank you. I'll be forever in your debt. Alright. Where's that at? Upstairs, I'm guessing. So the security terminal's in there. Um. You see him flash right there? I did. I'm going to take that. I'm going to take this. I got to get into that other room. I can't. Grand opening. 2015. Is there nothing else in this room? Terminal. Okay, we got to go talk to this thing. I, I'm going to read that again. 
mission items, ancient book, manifest. Why is why is we not have the thing? Find the ancient book, steal ten thousand. Do not trip the alarm with security logs. What? What happened to the thingy? Okay. Terminal is powered off. This is the one. Flip the switch to the bottom right and then plug in my data chip. <sighs> the script will dock to the security log so we can sneak you out. It's not going to. It's going to be a trap. It's executing now. And done. Get out of there. It's a trap. I almost guarantee it's a trap. Let's go back downstairs. I should have maybe done this first. Oh, well. I want to see if I can put that talisman somewhere. I don't want a zombie haunting me for the rest of the game. I'm just gonna run around. Huh. It's a data jack again. We got the shipping manifest. Oh, whoop, oh, sorry. That's uh the, the kiddo monitor going off. I'm on I'm on baby duty. Duty, I said duty right now. He's taking a nap, so I'm playing games. Hmm. Is it this thing? I don't know any maybe I can't find the item anywhere. Maybe I clicked the wrong thing. Wanted to free the dude. Whatevs. We're going to have a battle here coming up. I should have split this into two videos. Oh, well. Get out of here. Aha. Uh -huh, there it is. I knew it would get locked. And this guy would betray us. I like fighty battles, though. <laughs> Got it. This grenade launcher. Awesome. Duncan. Bring you right here. Gobbit still hasn't healed up. It's not going to do anything. Let's haste up. Good old blitz here. I guess you're standing out in the open. Here's grenade. Whoa! Shoot, man, that killed her. Wow. Okay, she got their Healy kit up. That's good. I didn't realize they'd be able to shoot over this thing. Got it. Can you not use this? There, that was good. That was great. Okay, and you still can't do it because that's not line of sight. No, it's in the open. Oh, you can. Alright. I'll keep spraying and praying at these guys. Blocked. I need to block something. Hmm. Oops, wrong button. I didn't want that. I guess these guys are pretty close. Cool. Wow! That does a ton of damage. That is ridiculous! And they didn't even try to get out of it. Keeps blocking things. I'm gonna reload. I'm gonna use that again. Because that was kind of cool. I like the grenade launcher. Doesn't even have to get right at him. Dunk in. Full on auto fire. Good work. Familiar voice. Change of plans. Search those bodies for a key fob. You'll need to access the side door. What? In the lobby. My program didn't work as well as I'd expected. 
I've been monitoring the exits on the cameras, and the police force have it locked, the front locked down. Since you can't go to the front right now, you've got to exit the side. That key will get you through the locked side door, which will take you to the east service door. We have to heal her up. I knew there was going to be another door, and more stuff to smash. We can't save her right now, either. What's going on? Oh. There's more guys in here. Can I buff? Heal wound. Heal her up. Yikes. It's not much. Okay, that'll, that'll be... Eh, we'll do another one here. I don't want Gaba to die on me again. Okay, we'll end the turn. Then we're going to come in here. That takes two. Let's get everyone close to the door. Then we'll end the turn again. It's kind of nice you can prepare before a turn now. Last game you couldn't. And turn, they don't even know where I'm at. Is there a pile of rotting flesh or anything in here that I can... Take some two. Let's move you here. Wait. I don't have an... I do have an armor spell. I should. Someone's got one. You gotta aim. That's the poison fog. There's the haste. Do I want a haste? Could haste Blitz. I'm going to haste Isabel. Because she's got this rocket launcher. Oops. Haste. Isabel. Okay, that means I can run in and shoot these guys. That's not the right guy. Great. Rocket launcher. Awesome. In we begin. Hey, hit him. Oh my! <laughs> Whee! That was terrible. Congratulations, you're the worst shot in the history of rocket launchers. Good one. Oh, he's got the sniper. Shoot, girl! And a shotty. And... Oh, this is gonna be good. I want to take out this guy. I should take him down, though. Hmm. You're flanked and in the open. I'm I'm taking you out every single time. 47%. I'm going to try it. Oh, wow. Good work. Wow. Amazing. These guys are hitting everything. There's a ley line over here. We'll try it. Missed everything. Hmm. Duncan will take him. Maybe. Okay. It's alright. Oh, actually hit me. Shoot. Oh, and I'm out of... Wait, that's the wrong guy. Here. Heal up. Can't do the poison cloud now. Put that on... on Blitz. Oh, it's on everyone. Shoot, I didn't know that. Okay, we'll reload this, and then we'll fire in here. Great. You too. There it is. Mission completed. Are you going to talk to me again? Or are we going to just leave? I can't take any more stuff from the level. Oh, well. Yes. Let's confirm. Go back to Hoi. 
And I think there'll be a screen here to read. Yes. Your adrenaline wanes as you fly through the subway tunnels and your way back to Hoi. There isn't much left but to pick the shards of glass off your clothes and congratulate yourselves on one good run. It's just too bad you couldn't keep looted antiques. By the end, you managed to steal over 5,000 new yen worth of items for your climate, a number that will hopefully be reflected in your mission pay. Damage you cause will likely set the museum's development back even further, but enough to, not enough to cripple the project, just enough to send a message. At the end of the day, you still managed to break a lot of exhibits, displays, and even the faces of a few tomb crawlers, the presence of which had conveniently slipped Drake's mind. Surprises aside, you came out on top. Thanks to some quick thinking on Drake's part, you got books and you got out. All right, guys, that's going to do it for a little bit of a longer episode. I guess we're at 50 minutes. That's cool, though. We got to get through this game, and we're getting a long time up. We got eight karma. That's like 10 total, right? I think we have like 10 now. We do. Oh, we're going to have fun with that next time. Anyway, keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. <laughs>